Wally has called us to Egypt for a vacation. Yes, next week we land in the country of pyramids, eh? Let's go. <laughs> hey, let me watch a few programs on TV and learn a little more about this beautiful country. <laughs> oh no, where's the TV? Uh... Forget the old school TV. Look what I've got for you. The latest technology modern TV. Projector! How's that? <sighs> hey, brother! You are simply the best! Oh, forget the mummies of Egypt! Let's watch the daddies of cricket today! Uh, uh, hey! This projector belongs to us and we get to decide whether we want to watch Egypt or cricket. And for now I'm in the mood to watch pop songs and dance my heart out! <laughs> no, brother! Entertainment is good! But I really want to go to Egypt! <laughs> 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 Come on, Larry Molly. We need to show them what real fun looks like. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> my body and mind need something refreshing. My muscle needs some hustle. <laughs> you can have your hot dogs later, Motu. Just get the projector and run for now. <laughs> to make sure this projector drives Colonel crazy, what say, guys? Or else we will change the name of our gang. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get fooled, brother. These mice are up to some mischief. There is no desert around you, eh? Ah! 
Distract Dawn and Colonel, okay? Gentlemen, may I have your attention, please? Our flight is going to land in the next few minutes. <laughs> Control room, there's a problem. Help needed. Help needed. <laughs> please fasten your seat belt. Oh no, where's the airport gone? <laughs> trying to tell you. These mice are the ones who mess things up. It's their fault. I am innocent. <laughs> Don't cry, little one. All is well. You don't worry. 
I am tired of this, bro. Tired of this. Hey, getting rid of these mice is an impossible task. How about we leave early for our Egypt trip? I'll call up Dilwale and tell him that we are coming to Egypt right away. How's that? Yeah! Wow, brother! But the mice should not know about this, huh? Hmm? And this is the pyramid of the greatest pharaoh of Egypt. History says that thousands of workers in those days made this grand pyramid by transporting and placing these huge stones with their bare hands. And that's why the Egyptians are famous for their marvelous pyramids, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Dilwale, King of Hearts speaking. Hey, brother colonel, you don't need to ask me. Visit any time, I'll welcome you with open arms. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. <laughs> We got wrong information, guys. Maybe they haven't changed their dates for the Egypt tour. <laughs> this feels so good, brother. We're finally going on a vacation without the mice. <laughs> you know I'm starving, little one. Come on, let's have some snacks. <laughs> uh? Wow, fermented bean rolls. Ow. <laughs> hey, 
How dare you do that? Why did you touch my lunchbox, huh? I'm sorry, sir. You're not allowed to carry a lunchbox on plane. We'll serve you lunch. Did you hear that? We'll get free food on the plane. Ah. This is the best airline. <laughs> <laughs> Our flight fares include meals as well. Yeah. <laughs> Did you guys start thinking you are smart enough to fool the mice gang so easily with your tricks? No problem! Here's a small gift from us! First, I'm going to explore all the pyramids in Egypt, and then, mummy. <laughs> I think I'll go and first have the milk that they drink, because it must be the super strong milk that gave them the energy to make those enormous pyramids without cranes. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, get walking! Flying is easy, and you can land safely. Dude, they want us to look like fools. Let's thrash them. <laughs> 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 
Shut your eyes, little one. We have only one option to save our lives. Come on. Hey, shut my eyes. Why would I do that? Because I asked you to do it. Now shut your eyes. <laughs> Brother, these pants are too small. What do we do with them? What an idea, brother! A parachute made out of pants! That's just brilliant! <laughs> oh, brother, look! We've got a suitcase! Throw it away, little one! No, brother! I've got all my stuff in the suitcase! The parachute is getting heavy! I said throw it! No, brother! <laughs> <laughs> Uh. Ah! Oops. Sorry, brother. Uh. Ah! Ah! Uh. <sighs> What is it? Stop! Hey, brother, let's pull the rod. It might be an elevator. We might get out of this spooky place, huh? Mm -hmm. uh huh? Huh? Uh huh? <laughs> <laughs> to disturb you. Please, feel free to go back to sleep. Uh, don't let him go. Ask him how do we get out of this place first. Come on. I'm really glad that you set me free from the chains that had locked me for years. Chains? Those mice deserve to be chained, isn't it? Not us. Huh? I am high risk. Consider me your master. Then you look into my iris. My master, I risk. How can I please you, my master? <laughs> I had been asleep for centuries. I want to regain my power and rule the world again. 
My name is High Risk. I'll be the most powerful ruler in the world. If anyone comes in my way, I'll quickly make them my personal slaves forever. And you are the first to join my army. High Risk is ready to launch an attack on the world. <laughs> Finally, we reached Egypt, but we'll need to make further plans to get Don and Colonel. <laughs> Don't worry, Larry. We got them. What? How did Don reach the airport so quickly, bro? <laughs> this is not Don, Motu. It is his uncle's son, Dilwale. And in Egypt, the success of our mission depends on this guy. Got it, guys? Let's go. Hey, I don't see Don and brother. Where are they? Haven't they come with you? Oh, it's a very sad story. The two brothers said they weren't happy with the plane's air conditioner. So they went out for a stroll and then... Ah, no! Brother, Don, oh, you can't do this to me. Have a problem with me sitting here, dude? I'm afraid, Mr. Camel. You will have to come with us. Why would I? Because our master, High Risk, has ordered that. Dude, I am my own master. Who is this High Risk? To know that you will have to come with us. What if I say no? Yeah. <laughs> 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 You will have to pay for this, Mr. High Risk. I am High Risk. Consider me your master. When you look into my eyes. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha 
Then both of you go and show them what our gang can do. What is wrong with them? Did Dawn and Colonel not see us here? And who's that strange fellow with them? Don and Colonel Brother, where were you guys? I thought you jumped off the plane and then, you know... Uh...
I am high risk. Consider me your master when you look into my iris. What is wrong with Dawn and Brother Colonel? <laughs> I think this magician has used his powers and hypnotized Dawn and Colonel. Yes, now the entire city is hypnotized. Oh, seems like he's a powerful magician. Yeah. Hey, Iris, leave my brothers alone, will you? Ah, shh. Quite. We need to follow them and find out where he's taking Doggy Dawn, Colonel, and all the others. Let's go. Hmm? How can I please you, master? Open the gates for us. And nobody else should be allowed inside. <laughs> Guys, we need to act like we are a part of their group and get inside to find out more about his plans, okay? You here, huh? Mr. Gutagu, please, we need your help urgently. <laughs> <laughs> you think this pigeon will help us in our mission, huh? <laughs> 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 he needs to be cooked with tomatoes and served hot with butter. <laughs> 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 hey, calm down, you guys. He is Mr. Kutargu, leader of the Pigeon Party. Um, please, please help us, sir. Look who is here. Since many centuries, I've been the guarding chief of this palace. And I've always had a fear that someday, High Risk would find out about this secret place. 
and try his best to take away the ring of power. <sighs> Here is my ring of power. Once I wear the ring, nobody would be able to stop me. And I will rule the entire world. <laughs> mm. <laughs> <laughs> Larry Molly, make sure that monster doesn't get away with that ring, you understand? Yes! <laughs> Consider me your master. When you look into my iris, Suddenly, and what happened to their eyes? <laughs> All of them have been hypnotized by high risk. But because you're such a dumbo, the hypnosis didn't work on you. Hey, 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 you! Wait, stop, stop right there! We've got to stop <laughs> him early. Come on. <laughs> Soldiers, get my ring and finish off that rat! Why are you doing this to me, brother? I'm your dear little brother, isn't it? <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
What is happening here? And why are we in this palace? Brother, I thought we were in a plane, and now we're here. What is happening? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I missed you! I'm so glad you're back to normal! I'm sure we got into trouble because of these mice. You troublemakers, I will not spare you! <laughs> 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 Don and Connell have gone crazy! <laughs> Let's teach them a lesson, what say guys? <laughs> Why are you fighting among yourselves, huh? Don't you realize that if we are divided, Iris will become more powerful and defeat us? Nobody can stop High Risk. Not these mice and doggies, for sure. <laughs> hey, we were busy fighting amongst ourselves, and Hyrus took away the ring without us knowing. <sighs> Let's not fight. <laughs> 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 Wake up, brave soldiers, and finish off the ones who want to harm your master. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. I know how to get rid of these monsters. Yeah. Oh. Um. <laughs> 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 yeah. Hmm. I guess my intense gym workouts will not help you. Get me out of here, little one. Hey, I can't do it alone. All of us have to come together and fight back to defeat this dangerous, evil monster! Yes! That's right, dude! United we stand and divided we fall! Let's do it together! We, we are, are the best! best. <laughs> 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 Hmm. <laughs> 
to go out and think of a strategy to fight these monster mummies. Let's go! Hmm. Hey, but where's Dilwale? Hey, brother! Yeah. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Where is High Risk taking Dilwale now? High Risk wishes to rule the entire world. We need to stop him. Quick! What are we waiting for? Come on, let's go! But brother, how can we stop such a powerful magician like High Risk? Any plans? Get a more powerful magician. Yeah. I know someone who could help us. Okay then, you guys. Mm. Help Mr. Guttergoo with his plan mm. and we'll go stop High Risk from causing any more damage. Mm. Larry Molly, let's go! Brother, it's time to attack, not hide. Let's mm. finish this monster. I think he has gone crazy with all the superpowers he has gained. Huh? People of the world, get ready for your new ruler, High Risk the Great. <laughs> get to walking, dear Sphinx. I want you to line up all the pyramids around us. Yay, 
brother, we need to warn everyone about this! <laughs> A magician much more powerful than High Risk has been hiding here for centuries! Uh, inside the river... a fish? But the river must be full of crocodiles of the Nile! Uh, brother, I'm super scared of crocodiles! <laughs> Doggy Don just called me and told me that High Risk is lining up all the pyramids. Yeah. Goga will tell you exactly why. In the meantime, I'll go and help Doggy Don and Colonel. They really need me. Okay? Now, who on earth is Mr. Goga? Goga Dial. The Crocodile of Nile. Got it? Ah! Hey, brother. Why is he getting these pyramids lined up? Uh, like this? He's not lining them up. It's a square little one. <laughs> you wait right here. Have no fear when Colonel is here. I'll get the map. By hook or by crook. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Huh? Brother! If he places all these pyramids as shown in the map, he will be successful in conquering the entire world! <sighs> we cannot let him do that, brother! Let's not talk anymore, little one. It's action time. Hey, brother, if we distract the Sphinx for a while, then we can slow down the process, right? Until then, the mice will get the other magician.
Who are you? Mr. Goga, I'm Charlie. We really need your help, sir. Not just Egypt. The entire world is in danger. That's not my problem. I have retired centuries ago. Go and don't disturb me. Mr. Goga, do you know all this is happening because of high risk? Huh? High risk? Uh, no, no. Uh, uh, go away. <laughs> you? How did you get in here? We don't speak to assistants. Go call your boss, Mr. Goga, right away. I am Mr. Goga. So the giant crocodile got freaked out when we mentioned high risk. <laughs> Everyone wants to laugh at me! They think I'm a cowardly crowd! <laughs> Larry, Larry, stop laughing! Uh, we are sorry, Mr. Goga. We never had any intentions of hurting your feelings, sir. I might be a giant croc, but I'm still a sweet baby at heart. I wasn't this cowardly croc always, you know. I used to study with high risk at school. He was a straight A student and I would barely clear my papers. But I was stopper at magic class. One day high risk burnt all my magic notes and I failed the class in my final year. <laughs> stop crying Mr. Goga, please stop. Cheaters need to be taught a lesson, isn't it? <laughs> and even my mommy and daddy stopped talking to me after that. I want to stay here forever. Okay, but we can't fight high risk without your help, Mr. Goga. We have no idea why he is moving the pyramids and lining them up suddenly. Please help. Oh no. He wants to conquer the world with his powers. I wonder what made him do that. What will he get with all this massive destruction, man? <laughs> please help us, Mr. Goga, please. <laughs> <laughs> Run! If he gets all the pyramids placed as per the map, the entire world will turn into a desert, brother! A huge desert! We need to stop him! Don't worry, little one. Just wait and watch what I do now. Just get me a rope.
Let me light up the torch first. Hmm. Hey, brother, the Sphinx was created using rocks in ancient Egypt. So, how about we use our rock climbing skills to get out of here? Hmm. Oh my, what an idea! You're such a genius. Let's do it. Consider me your master. No way! I won't let you do this to us again, huh? <laughs> Nobody can defeat High Risk the Great. <laughs> You. Oh, don't you remember what happened in school, Goga? You had failed in the final exams. A failure! <laughs> he failed because of Frank cheated him. We refuse to count these marks here. Huh? Yes, cheating is a bad thing. Don't worry, Mr. Goga. We are here to support you. <laughs> Mr. Goga, you were brought here for a reason. Do something. No. High risk was correct. I'm such a failure in life. I'm not more powerful than him. You guys fight with him. Take these. Ah. <laughs> 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 
Did he give us his magical powers? Oh, this makes me feel like I'm the Terminator. What's this? Hmm? Hey, Mr. Goga, your magic powers are so strong that we got some of your powers and we are doing wonders with it. Failure at school doesn't mean you have failed in life, my friend. Maybe you never got good grades, but when it comes to magic, you are a superstar. But, Hyrus... <sighs> Hyrus talks about your mark sheet all the time so that you lose all your confidence, Mr. Goga. Please understand. Yes, 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 you are right. Yes, yes. You are such a great magician and so talented. Don't get bothered with him. You can reappear for your exams. And I'm sure that you will do super good this time. Yes. <laughs> Why did I not think of this? Don't worry. When you defeat Hyrisk, the entire world would know that you are the best and the most talented magician ever. And they will say, Mr. Goga is the best. Yes. Yes! I can do it! That's like my boy! Larry Molly, let's get started! High risk! Here I come! Powerful on the planet. You cannot escape from me. Where are you hiding? Doggy Don, what do we do now? Our risk needs to be erased from Earth forever. But your brother Dilwale is still under his hypnotic spell. No, brother, Iris' spar lies in his eyes. His hypnotic spells make him powerful. To stop this menace, we will have to hypnotize him by any means necessary. But how do we do that? Goga is out of the battle, and my soldiers are way too exhausted. Get it? Hey, there's a way. Charlie, do you still have that projector with which you had landed a plane on our house the other day, huh? Oh yes, of course I have it. I always carry it in my pocket. Instant entertainment, anywhere and everywhere. <laughs> <sighs> if Hyrus hears his own hypnotic spells, then we can manage to get him hypnotized. Yes! Sounds like a good idea. But is that possible? Huh? All you need to do is follow me. <sighs> Finally, you surrender. Yes, Mr. Harris, you are the best. Yes, Mr. Harris, you are the best. <laughs> Mr. Harris, we have a final request for you. One last time. One last time. Could you hypnotize all of us, please? Have you lost your mind, little one? No, brother. This is part of my plan. Have you gone out of your mind, doggy dog? Please, Mr. Hyrus, one last time, show us your magical hypnosis. We'll record a video and share it on YouTube. And you will be a sensation. 
<laughs> the entire world will be hypnotized by your powers. <laughs> you will instantly have millions of slaves. No need to roam around for them, yeah? <laughs> wow, why didn't I think about this high-tech stuff before? Tell me, what needs to be done? Yeah, yes. You need to hypnotize him. No, please, no. All right, silly. These hypnotic spells and magic tricks don't work on your brain, don't you remember? I am high risk. Consider me your master when you look into my iris. <laughs> hey, Mr. High Risk, look at the screen. You are so powerful. Mm. Ah. I am high risk. Consider me your master when you look into my iris. Ah. 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 Ha, 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 ha.